All right, thank you, Carson. And with more snow on the way for Bozeman tomorrow, the people who plow our streets will be plenty busy. But here's the question. What exactly is the protocol for plowing streets? I mean, which streets get plowed first? MTN's Emma Hamilton has the answer for you. The plowing crews begin their 3 a.m. shift in November once leaf cleanup is complete. And that's where we have eight people doing eight routes every day, 3 a.m. If it's not snowing, like this morning, they were actually out sweeping and checking for potholes and doing work like that. Snow can cause delayed travel time, slippery roadways, accidents, and fender benders. But what exactly is the city of Bozeman's plowing strategy when we get this winter weather? The city has to get four inches of snow or more for the plows to go through residential areas during a storm. We want to get the arterials and collectors. We want to, you know, once you get out of your neighborhood, we want you to safely be able to get to work, to school, uh, maybe to the hospital. So that's where we concentrate our, our resources first, and then we'll go into the residentials. And it's usually, I would say, on the average, about three days after a snowstorm. The city of Bozeman plows 250 miles of city streets. North 19th, 7th, North Rouse, Main Street, and Huffine Lane are state roadways and are plowed and maintained by the Montana Department of Transportation. Now, if we compare this winter to our snowy winter last year, it's been a rather dry winter for us so far. And that's saving the city on sand and fuel costs as of right now. But this is Montana, and we know Mother Nature could give us any type of weather at any time. In Bozeman, Emma Hamilton, MTN News. And for a map of where the city plows, all you have to do is go to our website.